What's going on everybody? This child is back at the game, coming at you with another video for Awaken Chaos Era. In today's video, we're gonna show you guys all the spots you need to consider when trying to get yourself some free energy up in this mix, okay? So first and foremost here, let's go ahead and get the obvious out of the way when it comes to the quest lines that we can obtain between our daily quests and weekly quests and whatnot. And of course the events that are going on between the foodies guide, on the right side here and the hero development that we got going on. Even that, uh, let's not forget the magic pass uh, that we have available to us. We can obtain quite a bit of energy uh, in this spot here, quite a bit of uh, meal tickets or whatnot, just some free energy. Um, it's, it's definitely a very, very nice opportunity to do. Now, one thing that I wanna mention again, this is something that I make the mistake all the time is essentially uh, making sure that we're keeping up with our events here. Every single event, generally has some kind of energy that can be had. And as you guys can see right here, there's a couple of meal coupon, uh, meal coupon, meal coupon, meal coupons that you can obtain um, if you go ahead and do it here. Now, one of the things I definitely overlook, um, and again, it's, it shouldn't, right? Because of the fact that it says, it gives me an exclamation point, is all the way on the top right, um, the bread, the energy here. Every single day, we have the opportunity to get ourselves a free 120 energy here. So make sure that you guys are taking advantage of that. Um, if you haven't had the opportunity there, um, definitely uh, free energy, gotta take advantage of it. So I wanna go ahead and uh, bring that to your attention. In addition to that, uh, one of the things that I wanna discuss is also uh, the rewards in the shop, right? So if you guys go to the shop and go to your daily pack here, you also get yourself some free energy, daily free growth pack that you can obtain. And then we also have the weekly one as well, uh, which I think I've already collected if I recall already here, um, I think it's, yeah, I think I already collected that weekly one. So, but then that being said though, it's gonna be in the shop here. Uh, so make sure you, you check that out as well. Get yourself the weekly pack when it's available to you. I believe it's, uh, is it 80 energy? Uh, I forgot, I apologize in there, but it is a weekly pack nonetheless that you can obtain there. Uh, I believe it gives you gems as well, which again, if you wanna take the gems and turn it into energy, you can do that um, as well here. Um, so next thing that I wanna talk about here is gonna be the shop. If you guys click on the bartender here, you got the market and you got various uh, various shops that you can take a look at here. So you haven't had a chance to check it out. You can get yourself uh, various things here, the meal, uh, meal coupons here uh, per week. <clears throat> that's a really good reward. Uh, that's a really good uh, thing that you could do. And then of course you have some potential meal coupons you can obtain between the guild shop or guild vault, the arena shop, trial shop. We got an opportunity, I believe, to get some as well here. And then the event shop uh, as well. Now I will uh, we'll probably make a video down the road um, that we'll talk about some of the best things to collect along the way, you know, which ones are gonna be the best ones to want to do or if there's something else you should focus on. But I just wanna let you guys know that this is another place that you can uh, obtain it uh, if you choose so here. So <clears throat> now next up is gonna be the arena. This is something that I think we overlook quite a bit here. Um, if you guys did not know, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, the arena can you, can, you can obtain yourself quite a bit of energy here, basically. Uh, doing a specific match here generally yields you, um, I think some, a little bit of resources here as well as some free energy. Now the energy that you can obtain, I think can go up upwards of like 10 energy. Um, I believe I've seen 10 energy. Um, it's crazy to think that we can get that much here, but yeah, just making sure that you're doing your, your regular uh, arena wings, um, as much as possible. Um, that's definitely going to be the best way to, uh, uh one, one of the best ways here to get yourself some energy here. So as you guys can see, we get the victory. I get the kill here, and what do we obtain? We obtain uh, some pieces here for the arena shop, as well as that bread. And again, this can be uh, you know as low as four, but it could be as high as ten. And ten energy is is a fair amount of this game, right? In addition to that, um, as you guys already know, uh, we have you know as we're going through this game, we're getting ourselves all the free achievements uh, that you could obtain here. You're getting yourself a lot of free energy, but you're also gaining um, some arena tickets here. So if you're one of those people out there that are Super low on energy, and you're like, oh man, I've already done all these other things, Childish, what do I do here? Come on over to your backpack, take a look at your arena pack here, utilize these uh, arena wings so you can just get yourself um, a fair amount of energy if uh, things are a little things are a little rough here. But uh, overall, I think that's pretty much it. I can't think of anything else uh, that I would like to mess around here. Um, outside of the adventure, yeah, maybe the adventure mode. Um, the various adventure modes, clearing the content, um, as you guys know, uh, if you go to, let's say, um, one of the chapters here and you uh, hop back, after you clear specific stages on this one, uh, you'll be able to obtain, uh, again, uh, various rewards here. We got the crystals, we got the pumpkins, we got the uh, we got the shards here, the, the summoning shards, whatever you want to call it. But the reason why I say this is it is free diamonds, so sure, you can use it for your summons as well, but then if you want to, you can turn that into energy as well by coming up here, 
um, and spending 50 gems to get the 120. Is it worth it? Um, I honestly don't uh, think it's absolutely worth it, but if you're one of those people out there that are just utilizing what resources that this game has given to you, it, it, is, it is an option nonetheless here. Um, wanna go ahead and come back here, making sure that we, we talked about the uh, arena. Don't forget fam, to get your training in, uh, always do your training matches here. This is a, essentially 50 free crystals that you can obtain once again to go ahead and get yourself um, some additional like crystals that you can you know uh, spend into the uh, energy as well. And then last but not least, uh, the index here, as you guys can see, all the all the rewards that you can obtain by collecting specific units here. Um, you can get yourself a couple of diamonds here. You can save that for energy. You can use that for summons, whatever you want to do. But again, it is an option nonetheless for some free resources um, if you are running low on crystals here until the next event. So yeah, guys, I think that's going to be pretty much it for the video. Just wanted to touch base on all the spots that I recall as far as uh, getting it done, right? The quest line, the free energy, the shops, um, the events, and of course the PVP as well. Um, yeah, if you guys know of any other spot here, please leave a comment in the comment section down below, helping the community out so they can get some of that energy and uh, continuously farm uh, so we can get ourselves some nice gear, some goodness. And uh, yeah, just keep on pushing out in this game here. Again, if you guys are liking this content, please uh, stop what you're doing. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, and we will see you guys all in the next one. Take care.